everybody, Carol here. Welcome. Today I have another Christmas design and with using my calligraphy pen and uh, this is a large corner design using the elements of greenery and leaves and berries and spirals and uh, different things like that. I'm using red and green and brown uh, walnut ink and then at the end I come back and I add some gold, some Arabic gold metallic watercolor and so um, I hope you enjoy I'm going to speed it up quite a bit because it would take way too long to do it if I didn't and uh, for you to have to see it that is and then also I'm going to put on some music so I may talk along as I go and, and point out some of the things like uh, the, the greenery here made a very simple design simple strokes and uh, and I should add that I Got this idea from Suzanne Cunningham when I took her Deck the Halls calligraphy class. So, um, anyway, thank you again so much. Uh, doing the holly leaves and uh, little heart shaped leaves. And um, you can put a little uh, vein down the center for more realism if you want to. And then, um, again, just you'll be able to see if you watch the designs as they unfold and um, then again I have some other videos from the past one I did not long ago with the garland and then one before that there goes the red spiral with its dots and then I did one before that was a corner both corners opposite corners uh, designed smaller in the big corner so I can put another little one in the bottom that was an envelope this could be used on an envelope, certainly, and that it could also just be on a card or a tag or anything you might want to use for Christmas. So uh, name place cards uh, are nice for designs like this. So again, just following the little dots, uh, simple, just take a little bit of time. And then um, when the gold comes, I wasn't pleased so much with the uh, brown strokes I didn't think I made a uh, the curly cues I didn't think I made a good I don't know I just wasn't satisfied with it so I thought well this is the perfect place to come back and top it off with some gold now I did uh, one of those I changed because I wanted it to be a bigger thicker I didn't too much like the way it looked so I made it a bigger thicker uh, scroll kind of like a large ribbon and there I am adding water to the gold and stirring it up and then dropping it on the back side of the nib, the reservoir. And so, um, anyway, and I was fighting the sunlight this whole time. <laughs> and I was using it in a room that has a lot of windows. And uh, I just thought, I'm just going to have to move it into the shade. And actually, you can see it better that way. So, um, anyway, that's what that, that was that, some part of that you can't even see very well because of the sun. But anyway, you certainly get the idea and you'll see the final pictures. At the very end, when I do add the pictures, uh, the still shots, I go ahead and put with, uh, at the very end with the, this photo, I put the garland in. So you can see the connection. There's the gold. If you hold it up to the light, it just shines so beautifully. And I wanted you to see that. So as I add these, um, this other picture with it, you can see the connection between the two and how pretty they would be even together but you could definitely have a theme at christmas time and even next christmas carry out the theme once again so anyway thank you so much for being here i appreciate it i hope you enjoyed and uh hope to be back soon so join me then you can uh, subscribe and hit the bell and be notified when the next one comes out or just check back uh, from time to time and see so thanks again have a great day until next time Bye-bye.